Good morning everyone. I hope you are fine. Today I am going to share a story about the hunter's promise. So first of all, I will start my story. Once upon a time there lived a brave hunter whose name was Tira. He loved hunting wild animals in the forest and took great pride in his skill. He lived in a small but pretty house surrounded by trees which grew thickly together forming beautiful shapes little paths wound themselves around the trees and here and there fountains of water sprang from the hills and ran down into the valley One day as usual Shira went into the forest to hunt he did among the trees and waited for his prey hearing the rustling of dry leaves nearby he fitted arrows to his bow and shot them one after another but they missed their mark and the hidden animal escaped shira waited the whole day but shot nothing the sky grew overcast and darkness began to engulf the forest It started to drizzle but Shira did not want to return home empty handed he walked on and on in the rain then he saw a beautiful lake situated in the middle of the woods as he got closer to it he heard a strange sound as if someone was in great pain as soon as he reached the lake he spotted a beautiful crane her feet were caught in the weeds on the bank of the lake for a moment he was happy at last he had found his prey he would kill the crane and take her home but when he saw the agony of the beautiful bird his heart melted he did not have the heart to kill a creature which was already crying in pain and wanted to be saved So he went near the bird and said don't worry i will remove these weeds from around your feet the crane looked at him gratefully and said i will be very thankful if you help me i have aged parents who were waiting for me to get their food they do not have anybody else if i do not return they will die waiting for me shira distangled the crane from the weeds and helped her to fly home although he was a hunter he had saved a bird instead of killing her he went to home empty handed but was very happy this incident changed shira he no longer took pleasure in hunting but was very happy whenever he could rescue birds and animals from the traps of older hunters he started placing food and water for birds and animals around his house hoping they would come and go freely one day there was a knock on his door when he opened it he saw a beautiful little girl standing outside she said may i stay with you i am all alone i will help you I won't be my any trouble to you. Shira was delighted to see this lovely girl. He thanked God for sending her and he had started feeling lonely in the forest. So he said, "Yes, of course you can stay." She said, "But I have one condition. You will never enter my room without my permission or even peep into it." "I promise," said Shira readily. Shira and the girl were happy together. Every morning the girl would present him with a beautiful shawl made of pure white feathers. Shira would take it to the market and sell it for a good sum of money. As the days went by Shira became a little curious to know why the girl never let him enter her room without her permission. So one day when she went to her room Shira slowly opened the door to see what was what she was doing and what did he see standing in the room was the beautiful crane whom he had saved near the lake
The crane was slowly pulling out her own feathers and making a shawl. When the crane saw Shira, her eyes filled with tears. You have broken your promise, said the crane. I can't stay with you any longer. Take this shawl. It is my last present to you. So saying, the crane flew away into the forest and Shira never saw her again. Thank you. I hope you like this video. May Allah bless you.